I'm Dr. Bobby Lazara for today's Medical News Minute. Recently, an infant with genetic material from three adults was carried to term. The procedure was completed in Mexico by a U.S. fertility expert because the procedure is not yet approved in the United States. The reason for the procedure, called a spindle nuclear transfer, was to reduce the risk of Lee syndrome, a mitochondrial disease that had resulted in four miscarriages and the death of two children for a Jordanian couple. Sperm from the father and genetic nucleus from the mother were implanted into the egg cell of a woman whose genetic material had been removed, but still contained the genetic material of her mitochondria. There are, of course, two sides to this procedure, the life-saving, opening scientific doors to cure disease side, and the manipulation of life, gene-altering, designer baby side. You see, mitochondrial DNA is passed from mother to her children, with her female children passing the genetic information on to the rest of the lineage. So creating genetically altered female embryos can permanently alter the human lineage. No take-home message today, just food for thought. And by the way, the baby born in this case at 37 weeks was a boy. I'm Dr. Bobby Lazara for the Medical News Minute.